with the show, but not quite. Live shot there of downtown Vancouver. We're going to head to Port Coquitlam right now. Familiar face on the show, BT correspondent Tina Barkley. you got a bunch of kids there, and uh, we're learning about a breakfast program that is ensuring that no kid goes to school hungry. And I know it's a little busy down there, so why don't you just take it away, Tina? Busy is right, Thor, and apparently this happens every day, so it's an unbelievable experience. I'm at James Park Elementary School learning all about the Grocery Foundation and their commitment to a program called Toonies for Tummies, a breakfast program that ensures that kids aren't going to school hungry. And the program's really only possible with sponsors and retailers. Uh, and of course, I'm joined now by Daryl Jones, CEO of Save on Foods. Daryl, tell me how did Save on Foods get involved? I heard you were the first retailer to bring it out. Well, it started in, the, in eastern Canada. Three years ago, we became part of, uh, of Toonies for Tummies, a fantastic thing. You can see all the kids here having a good breakfast, which is what you need to start the day. We, like I said, we started about three years ago. We've raised um, just about $700,000 for the kids. Stop by your local Save On food store for the next two weeks. The cashier will say, do you want to give uh, Toonies for Tummies? You just donate your $2. And on the 19th, will match all the Toonies for Tummies donations for the kids, and you can see what it can do for everybody here today. It's very exciting. We're, we're very proud to be part of it. Oh, and your efforts are appreciated. There's so many kids and their families actually eating here as well today. I wanted to talk to Kathy McKinney. Kathy, you're a volunteer parent here at the school. Tell me, what does this mean for the families in the community here? Um, the breakfast program, I think, is just a sense of community in total, um, not just for the school, right? We've had um, a, a huge growth in the program, and a number of the children come here and they rely on it. It's a consistent um, presence for them, and they get to enjoy breakfast mixed with everyone in the school. And it, uh, because it's an inclusive program, we encourage the children and their families and their parents and their siblings to come and have breakfast together. Um, and everyone goes to school with a nice full stomach. And um, we couldn't do it without uh, sponsorship and donations. And uh, it, it's a feel good for me. I, it's not a task to come here. It's a joy and a pleasure, as it is and, for everybody else. And I hear that you've you've um, served 15,000 meals since September. 15,000 meals, Thor. Isn't that incredible? What an amazing initiative there. Yeah, good stuff. Thanks so much, Tina. That was awesome. And uh, we hope to see you again soon. Thanks, All right. I love that, Tina Barkley.